Yeah, it needs to change also the narrative, right? And one of the things that people need to understand to understand what you guys are doing is something called state channels. Yeah. That was invented by Consensus, one of the biggest... Uh, Consensus worked on it. I think there was a paper in 2015. I cannot mm -hmm. remember who did that paper. Everybody worked. It was a collaborative effort like the radio. Like the radio, it was not a single man's effort. It was many people did different parts and then we have the radio. What are state channels? Explain simply. So, for example, when you go and you go and buy coffee and then you can pay every day and you pay your coffee or you can have a tab and every time you order a coffee, they just mark one, one more coffee, one more coffee or or a tab at the restaurant and every time you take a drink, uh, they add uh, to your tab. And then once you want to finalize before you leave, you close the transaction and that is what is written on the ledger and you get one invoice. You don't get an invoice for every, so it's more efficient. You don't need to write it every time. You have your tab, everything happens offline. And when I say offline, there is no tax records, but that's okay for the tax authorities, except that you have a tab. As long as it's settled every, whenever. You know, mm. so maybe every day, every month. I think an example that uh, one of your colleagues gave me was also maybe for a kind of younger generation to understand Splitwise. Splitwise is this application that a uh, group of friends use. For example, if you have if you have flatmates, right? Yeah. Or if you have a group of friends and yeah. you go on holiday and you don't want to, you're basically going to share money, right? Oh, I'm going to pay for this, I'm going to pay yeah. for that, etc you want to have a place where you record every payment you do without actually doing the payment to one another. And at yes. the end, you, you will owe some money to some people, some people yeah. will owe money, and yeah. there's this, this final, basically this final this line, which is, yeah. which is how much, who owes who what, yeah. and the payment is done only once, right? Or the transaction is done only once. Yeah. And so state channels is that, applied on Bitcoin would be for payments, right? Yeah. And applied to trading would be what you guys are doing. So uh, streaming of money. So it's streaming the profit. So the cool thing about state channels is that we are trading and we have locked some money, like we have put $20,000 each on the table or $20. And <laughs> depending, <laughs> <laughs> depending how much you're trading. <laughs> we both put some money on the table, okay? And uh, this money is governed by a smart contract. So it's, a th it's this automatic th robot third party that is controlling. And we start to trade and you're making some money and State Channels is streaming the money instantly to you. So you don't have to worry about me walking away and not paying you because the money is, is being streamed. The profit, if I lose, uh, it's being taken away from me. And if you win, it's being sent to me. So this, we have the money here and then it's, the profit is being streamed instantly, you know? So if this is, the, if this is the money, you know, and then, and then I'm, we both locked money into the smart contract. And then as soon as I'm winning, you know, all, everything is flowing to me automatically, but then the market turns and then it starts to flow to you. And this is state channels. It's like this flow in and out.